once again, no one is in that direction. But if I talk this way, this way, I can get on a boat. I don't even have to talk to the boat. I can just go into it. I should talk to you more about combat. I should fight more monsters. Why? Because. There are some new ones around here. It might be worth getting some experience and gold from. Yes, our old friend the Demigos is here. But we also have this combination. I know you've seen this before. But little correction. An enchanter can cast infernos. So you would have want him out as soon as possible. Or at least silenced. Decision is yours. How should they die? But if this spell has no effect, you might be in trouble. And if you have different types of spellcasters attacking you, it can get disastrous really fast. Or you can use some new stuff that you find, like that wizard wand as an item. Yes. Has an effect of fireball. Too bad for the enchanter is about to be completely missed because of the surround spell done earlier. Oh, that was rather painful. Let's not do that again. Oh yeah. New more learned outside. Which will take you out of the dungeon, of course. And here's a new enemy. The Mud Man. He's muddy mad. And just to show you what he does, he'll get a round off anyway, because he has about 20 hit points. To be more exact, 27. I didn't let him do it this time. They don't really hit hard, but they have this nice ability called Jig, which can steal magic points. Yeah, somewhere between 7 and 13 magic points. Completely lost. Until you rest again. But still, extremely annoying. And he's not the only monster with him. So there was this one thing on this continent that I did find. It looked a little nook and cranny. It's this monolith. But there's a slight problem. Of course! I do not have a golden key for the wooden gold door. Kinda reddish. The Dippy Ghost doesn't always attack twice per round. In fact, I only seen it attack once so far. So my sources may be incorrect. That happens a lot. And yeah, Illy has a spell of repel now. I can not meet weak monsters. But there's still another monster I want you to meet. It's ridiculous. It really is. It's not showing up today. Why is our friend not showing up? Oh my, I got a lottery ticket from a carnivog. And of course, next level. New War is up to 14. That's pretty good. And his new spell. Heal more! He finally learned heal more. Took it long enough. I guess Illy had to teach him eventually. Hey, there we go! Magic baboons! Would it surprise you that they don't cast magic? They have around 42 hit points. They actually don't hit quite as hard as their uh, cousins. 
But there's a big problem. If I allow them to do it. They will call for help. Yes, baboons that call for help. So we'll defeat them quickly. But of course, if there's not enough room on the screen, they won't be able to call for help as much as they want to. So keep that in mind as well if they show up with their friends, the Magic Drakies. And they do often. Then you've got a problem with how hard they hit. But that's not all the enemies we have to worry about. What about the ones in the ocean? Well, allow me to recover real quick. And I'll be able to show you. Also, the close hiding is actually real good statistic-wise. Good armor. It might even be better than the chainmail. I'll have to double-check that later. Newmore might want to get a hold of that. Until then, let's travel along the ocean to our next destination and meet some of our friends. The Man of Wars. They look like healers. Except they don't heal. They're no big deal. 20 hit points. Although they do give out a good amount of gold. There is a slight chance if you get hit by one of them. That that character will faint. Yeah, go to sleep. I know, that's silly. But there's a few friends out here. That could cause you trouble. It's our friends, the Medusa Balls. The ones that cast leap. Yeah. Good thing they're susceptible to sleep as well. Stop spell doesn't quite work as well, though, I've noticed. So the quicker you win, the better off you are. And around this huge new continent we go. Now I know the Medusa Balls are probably just some weird monster, but I wonder if they're actually female. And why they weren't called Gorgon Balls. Gorgon is the proper term for a Medusa species. Medusa is a woman. A woman that causes a lot of trouble. Sea slugs! And as you figure, they're not much of a threat if I'm going for the Medusa Ball. Seriously. Yeah, they have a little oomph. But outside of poison, and supposedly they can make you go to sleep as well. Only 32 hit points, plus or minus, but a real good amount of gold. Supposedly they call for help as well. But they'll be long dead before that. So what's this giant new continent I'm about to make Lane fall on eventually? I hope you didn't see my mouse cursor. That would make me look unprofessional. It looks slightly familiar, does it not? Especially when you see this right here. Two castles, barely separated by a river. Yep, you guessed it. We're back in the kingdom, the continent, uh, Alephgard, with Tantagil Castle and Charlock on the other side. So we should meet our buddy, the king, in our next video, and see if the inhabitants have really changed over time, and reminisce in nostalgia over all the areas that are not here now.